Hey Tom, I wish you didn't have to attend school on your birthday. So do I, Donna. But we get out of school at 4.15 after advisory, in which I'll see you then. I'll be home around 4.45, that's for sure. Okay class, before I say this, according to YouTube user Worldwide Railfin's latest post in the community tab, I believe September's this month on the railroad is going to be a couple days late, but when you guys return from the weekend, we'll get there and I'll discuss September's railroad events with you, such as the new Amtrak 50th Anniversary Pepsi Can-8 Heritage Unit, the recent Amtrak derailment in Montana, and other railroad events that occurred last month. In case you haven't noticed, the Whistle Stop Tour is from October 8th to October 10th, so mark your calendars, unless you have a trip planned. During the weekend, 36 passengers, including some of you who attend my class as an elective, will have the unique opportunity to travel along with virtual railfin staff on the original route of the Broadway Limited from New York to Pittsburgh and return in two meticulously restored private rail cars from the post-war era, one of which is an original car from the 1949 Broadway Limited train set. Passengers aboard the 2021 Whistle Stop Tour will ride in first-class style aboard the Catalpa Falls, a 1949 Pennsylvania Railroad sleeper lounge that is now privately owned by Executive Rail. Accompanying it will be Executive Rail's newly renovated Chester County, a former New York Central parlor car built in 1946. The trip will traverse several significant railroading sites, including Philadelphia's iconic 30th Street Station, the Rockville Bridge, a National Historic Civil Engineering landmark, and of course, the famous Horseshoe Curve. Riders will be treated to authentic 1949 cuisine, lifted from the original Broadway Limited menus and prepared to the original Pennsylvania Railroad recipes. If you have any questions regarding the Whistle Stop Tour, please reach out to me or any member of Virtual Rail Fund there by going to their Facebook page or the community tab on their channel in any of their posts. Well, I need to ask Darren and Raleigh to take me and Tom to Marilita, Trevor, and Zabeth's house to throw him a birthday surprise this weekend, that's for sure. But because we are going camping next weekend, I believe this Whistle Stop Tour is not on the books for us. Trevor and Zabeth, Tom, Ben, Darren, and Riley will be there sooner or later. In the meantime, we'll make Tom's birthday cake, one part French, one part Norwegian, and one part Danish. We start off with butter, sugar, and flour. Then we add an egg. And most important of all, the chocolate chips. Well, in that case, Amanda Pillsbury, one of our friends at school, told us that she loves Pillsbury products. Only if we use the branded cake mix that Darren's strict parents had recommended. Wow. Maralita, are you making a chocolate cake, one part for each country in Europe where we originated from? You know Tom loves chocolate cake for one part for each country he recently visited in the past. Check out the app called My Talking Tom. Tom always travels around the world and so does Angela in her new app My Talking Angela too. I give it a stir. Hey, Maralita. Can I stir? Yes, Trevor, you can. I love stirring. I want to go. Trevor, Zabeth, that's enough stirring. Now let's pour the batter into the pan, then I'll put it in the oven for 10 minutes at 385 degrees. Riley, Tom, and Ben, are you all ready to go to Maralita, Trevor, and Zabeth's house for Tom's surprise party? Serena called and said that Mau Mau is sick with the flu. He, along with Leanne Rimes, Badger Klops, Adora Bat, and Tanya Keys as well as his caregiver, Serena, are not coming. Let's hope Mau Mau heals so he can tell Tom what he missed during Tom's special day. Miralida, Trevor, and Zabeth have invited a few friends of ours, who are Catherine, Nola, and Tyra, and they invited me for a surprise party, as well as Ben, Riley, and you, Darren, so let's go before they cancel. Happy birthday, Tom! There is only one candle, only to make sure I get the right wish, and the wish is I want to work at an antique store like in the 1963 movie starring Jerry Lewis, who's minding the store. Well, you've made your wish, 
even when this store is from the 1963 movie starring Jerry Lewis, who's minding the store. Now blow out that candle and make that wish come alive, and you'll receive the 1963 movie, Who's Minding the Store starring Jerry Lewis on DVD in no time flat. All right, now that I received a copy of the 1963 movie starring Jerry Lewis, Who's Minding the Store, from one of my friends named Eli Albemarle, and the chair can hold Catherine, and that me, Darren, and Riley have to sit on the couch and the rest will have to sit on the floor for the duration of the movie, and yes, snacks and drinks will be provided throughout the duration of the 48-year-old movie on Miralita's LG flat screen TV. I call that a surprise movie night, that's for sure. <laughs> Microsoft Sam's Bible verse of the day reads, Psalm chapter 34 verse 3, Glorify the Lord with me, let us exalt his name together. Just like the street lights lit this town, like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down. Can't be afraid to live this out, we got this far, don't know how. EA Sports, it's in the game.